What's up, friends and family of the vlog? What are you doing? It is Saturday. We're hyped up. Ed's working on his car. I'm doing my thing. My thing is nothing. What are you doing, Ed? I just want to say that I'm not as hyped as CJ is because, wow. Um, you just weren't ready for all the power, I man. I am hyped about getting my stock wiring harness and EC removed. Ooh! Donnie's excited. <laughs> uh, we are going to be putting a hybrid EMS standalone on it. It comes with its own wiring harness, has flying leads. And what uh, is that kit? Like the the name of that company? Hybrid EMS. Hybrid EMS. And what does that do? Uh, it replaces my stock ECU, my mm -hmm. stock wiring harness. The wiring harness that comes with it comes with uh, flying leads, they call them. Mm -hmm. and what are those flying leads for? The flying leads are going to go to each one of my sensors. Like this without a plug would be a flying lead. So okay. what I did was I actually bought a complete uh, connection kit. It comes with all new plugs and pins. Mm -hmm. um, and that I'm going to put directly onto my flying lead harness. Okay. So we're going to get all this taken off today. And then uh, I'm going to have my buddy come over, Nick. Uh, he owns Hybrid EMS. And he's going to help us do the install on it just so everything goes smoothly. And we hope to be able to use them some in the future too. So. Awesome. Yep. So what's the reason why you're changing all this? Uh, because I'm tired of dealing with 25-year-old Nissan electronics when I don't have to. That makes a lot of sense. All right, Donnie. What's up? So you got some My lines day. on yes. your pad here. Yes, I do. Yep. What are those for? So the lines on the pad mm -hmm. is to make sure that it's always spinning. Always spinning. Because okay. if you ain't spinning, you ain't cut. If you want to come over here and look, yep. I, don't know I would you love to come over here and I don't join know if you. you're going to be able to look at it on the camera and see we, it. We're going to see it. All right. Go ahead, girl. So with the pressure, you see that it's not rotating. See how you can see the lines right there? It's not rotating. Yeah. It's just vibrate. I got you. You don't want that because you're not doing enough. It's not cut. It's not doing enough. Yeah. So either the speed setting's on one mm -hmm. right now. And we got a good amount of pressure on it because you got to put pressure on it to cut it. So in that case, you need to turn your speed up. Turn your speed up so when it starts rotating. Now you're cutting. Now you're cutting. See how the lines are moving? Before they were just staying in the same spot. Right. That right there, that's going to cause you cut. I if got you're just you. vibrating, you're really not doing nothing. The higher it's, the speed, yeah. the more you're cutting. Right. Exactly. So you gotta account for oh, I'm pressure cutting and off speed. half your face. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> so is this your hybrid EMS kit? No, this is the uh, clip kit that I got from Wiring Specialties. Uh, yep. Nick is coming with your kit, right? Nick has the kit, yeah. Okay, but these it. are all of the connectors, They're your pins. Kit. These are the seals for all the connectors. Yep. And it's all laid out all in the order out. that it needs to go in, right? I don't know if it's in the order that needs to go in, but it has all my connectors that I need here, so. Okay. Yeah. Pretty sick. This is some nice high quality packaging. Get the man the belt. What? <laughs> So you got your other harness out, your old ECU. Yep. I'm not gonna throw the ECU, because it's still a good ECU. Good job. Thanks. <laughs> yeah, look how clean it looks though without any wiring. Isn't that like sick? It's a full tuck. So sick! Not a full tuck, because you got like wires hey, here. I'm and talking about up here. Fuse box, I got fuse the box there. They're sick. Bluetooth. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Ed, so uh, what's the next step? Next step is going to be to put the ECU in. Um, I have to make sure there's enough room for it. It has a couple of relays. The ECU itself is only like this big. So, safe space. Yep. So I got that, safe space. Yeah, we know about your safe space. It's the bar. What's your name? Nick, Nick, nice to meet you, Nick. Nice to meet you too. All right, so we have Nick here today, just uh, putting it together. It's harnessed to go back in his car. He's the almost there. We're about to start installing the harness. Okay. Uh, once we install the harness, then we have to cut all of our links to the right length, and then uh, crimp the connectors on. Gotcha. Man, There's yeah. All the connectors. Yeah. This is crazy though. It is, with, it's pretty I nice. wouldn't want to fool with wiring. It seems like really like a real tedious thing. But. 
That's why we have the master. Yes. <laughs> he doesn't like wiring. No, I would I would hate wiring. <clears throat> I mean, I know that the red wire is generally positive. It's, well it's duh. <laughs> <clears throat> Forgot to introduce you guys to Adam. On, guys. What are you doing over here, man? Pulling some coilovers. Gonna go to rebuild tomorrow. Okay. Yeah. Interesting. That's about it. You enjoying yourself so far, man? Loving it, man. Awesome. I'm doing it for free. Don't tell Chris. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Adam is new here, but he's doing an awesome job so far, guys. So I just wanted to introduce you. Hello, YouTube. My name is CJ. I hope your mom watches this. She does, man. She watches every yes! single one. Yes. Shout out to you, Mom, for hooking us up with awesome egg sandwiches every morning. You the real MVP. <laughs> Wait a minute. I don't get it. Alright, so sandwiches. my mother is the greatest woman alive. She uh she makes me egg sandwiches. I live at home. I'm only 20. I'm a bum, I know. But uh she makes me egg sandwiches every morning. She's the greatest. And she makes Ed an egg sandwich every morning too. What? She does as of like two weeks ago. It's so good. It's yep. so good. Every, well, and every morning the CJ gets egg, it. cheese, ham, or bacon, or sausage on an everything bagel. Hey. Oh, All right, damn, he's got the side left. Hey, Donnie. Hey. Hey, Donnie. Hey, Donnie. Hey, Donnie. Hey, Donnie. Hey, Donnie. What are you doing? Done. Sure about that? thing looks crazy. It's like the paint just sucks you in. It's oh, so blue. Yeah, we have a blue. We have two gray ones coming in. Yeah, that's the one you imported. Yeah, we got that blue one that's took down two gray ones, actually a black one as well. Yeah. But the black one, you think, it's got a little damage here and there, like almost all over. Um, so we're going to probably paint it either Bayside Blue or Midnight Purple. But see, this one here, you know, this color transport over here because in the pictures this wasn't cracked up like this so it hit right here it smashed this up and then also messed this up a little right here it's just I saw that one. it's what happens you know when it's super low like this you just you all still working on this? it's the risk you run yeah we're gonna we got a guy who might buy it just the way it is um, otherwise we gotta do some paint work we gotta get this Bumper fixed up, and then we'll get this cheap grill out of here and put some of our nice grill mesh in there. <laughs> Pretty quick, man. Like, you gotta be careful, it'll spin in third gear. Yeah, yeah. I mean, normal, you know, first, first gear for sure, second gear sometimes. Usually, you get in the third gear, it's hooked up pretty good. But this will start spinning. It's powerful. So Chris just putting a plate on now and going out for a test drive with the customer. <laughs> I'll get in the back. Alright, I'm getting in. <laughs> Ready? I can sit in the back. You gonna squeeze on in there? Oh boy. There you go. I'm in. <laughs> you guys so all set? Everybody yep. all set? Yep. Uh, thanks to the crew. Awesome. Thank you. Cool. Thank you guys. Thank yeah. you guys. Thanks, Chris. Right. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Really. Very Thank much. You so much. Very much. Right. So, just, uh, Maybe when you get home, shoot me a message and just let me know that you know you got home safe. Yeah, yeah. everything you know, you made it home. Everything was good and all that. And then just if you have any questions at all, just please don't hesitate to give me a call. Okay. All right. There she goes. And she gone.
<laughs> gone. Another car. Another car. Some more happy customers. Yes, congratulations, bro. Thanks. stock twin turbos and I hopped it up and did some work to it and stuff made it faster but then uh, I had to have a six speed so I went and bought a six speed I already had a single turbo on it and uh, when I got it it maybe made like 500 horsepower when I got through with it I was at uh, 765 and there she goes 